What is going on guys, it is Steven, your semi-comprehensive guide here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you how to game share games between a PlayStation 4 and a PlayStation 5 console. So if you and your friend were game sharing between your two PlayStation 4s and one of you upgraded to a PlayStation 5, you might be wondering if you can still game share between your two consoles. Also, you might be wondering if you can game share the PlayStation Plus collection games to a PlayStation 4, since they are free on PlayStation 5. So I'll be answering both of those questions in today's video. Now, if you're not familiar with the game sharing process, I have more in-depth tutorials on how to game share between two PlayStation 4 consoles or two PlayStation 5 consoles. So if you want to learn more about this process, be sure to watch one of those videos that are in the description down below. But today I'm mainly going to be focusing on what we have to do to game share games between a PlayStation 4 and a PlayStation 5 console. So if you're having any issues with this process, those tutorials down below will also help you out because I go through a lot of different issues you might run into game sharing on either console. So let's get into the actual tutorial now. So I'm going to first show you how to game share games from a PlayStation 5 to a PlayStation 4 console. So if you own a PlayStation 5 and you want to game share games with your friend who has a PlayStation 4, you really don't have to do much on your PlayStation 5, just be sure that your user is logged in with a PlayStation Network account, and it is playable on the console. Now, over on your friend's PlayStation 4, add your user to the console if it is not added already. So, be sure that you are logged into the same PlayStation Network account that you were logged into on your PlayStation 5, and then once you are signed in, go to the home menu of your friend's console, then go to settings, down to account management, then go down to activate as your primary PlayStation 4, and be sure that activate is selected if it is not already. Once our PlayStation 4 has been activated as our primary, we can go back to the home menu, and we can go to the library, and in here we should see all of our games that we want to game share. So be sure to stay logged in as your user, and download all the games that your friend wants on his PlayStation 4. Once they are downloaded, then you can log out of your user, and now any user on your friend's console can play these games as if they were their own. So that's a pretty simple process for game sharing between your PlayStation 4, 5 and your PlayStation 4, but you might be wondering if you can also game share your PlayStation 5 games with your friend on his PlayStation 4. And the answer is probably not. 90% um, of PlayStation 5 games are exclusive to the PlayStation 5, but there are a few, like Spider-Man Miles Morales, that are both on the PlayStation 5 and the PlayStation 4, so if you get the cross-platform version of the game, you can game share it to the PlayStation 4. Now, like I mentioned earlier, a lot of people are going to want to game share the PlayStation Plus collection to a PlayStation 4. So to do that, just add the PlayStation Plus collection games to your library. So go to the store, just select add to library, and once they are in your library, they should appear on the PlayStation 4 console that you are game sharing with. So same process as before, be sure you're logged in as the user that is on the PlayStation 5, then download the games to the PlayStation 4 console, and once they are done installing, you can log out and play them as any user on the PlayStation 4. So that does it for the uh, PlayStation 5 to PlayStation 4 method, but what if you want to game share your PlayStation 4 library on your new PlayStation 5 console, or if your friend has a large PlayStation 4 game library and you want that on your PlayStation 5 as well? Well, to do this, we basically do the same steps except on the PlayStation 5. So this time I'm going to be doing it from the perspective of your friend game sharing his PlayStation 4 games to your PlayStation 5 console. So just like before, add your friend's user to your PlayStation 5. Be sure that he is logged in with the same PlayStation. PlayStation Network information that is on the PlayStation 4, and once he's logged in from the home screen, head up to settings, then go down to users and accounts, then go down to other, and then select console sharing. In here, be sure that it is enabled, so if you see the disable option like I have right here, just leave it as is, but if you see enable, be sure to enable console sharing, and once that has been enabled, you can go back to the home screen, down to the library, and now we can install all the games that we want on this console. So stay logged in as your friend's user and install all of his games games that you want on the PlayStation 5. Once they're done installing, we can log out of his user, and we can log into any other user on this PlayStation 5 and play his games as if they were our own. So using this method, you will also get the DLC that is included with any PS4 game that you might have, and you will also get PlayStation Plus if your friend has that as well. It's also the same if you game share from the PlayStation 5 to the PlayStation 4, you get DLC and PlayStation Plus. So that about does it for today's tutorial. If you enjoyed, leave a like down below. If you have any questions, leave those in the description. Any ideas for future videos, also leave those down below. Other than that, I've been Steven, your semi-comprehensive guide, and be sure to have a wonderful rest of your day. Okay.